here you can see the numbers 5 and 7. Now somebody might ask you, which number is larger? Now you probably know that the number 7 is larger. 7 is more than 5, or 5 is less than 7. But we have special symbols which we use when we're comparing two numbers. Here is the symbol we use to show less than. Now a good way to remember what this symbol looks like is to think of the mouth of a crocodile. So here we have our crocodile and it's a very hungry crocodile so it's snapping its mouth towards the larger number. Now let's compare the numbers 8 and 2. You know that 8 is larger than 2 or we could say 8 is greater than 2. So here we use the symbol for greater than which looks like this. And again you can imagine a crocodile snapping its mouth at the larger number. Now we have the numbers 1 and 2. Would we say 1 is less than 2 or greater than 2? Well 1 is the smaller number so we say 1 is less than 2. And which symbol are we going to use? Which number will our crocodile be snapping at? Well we use the less than symbol with our crocodile snapping at the number 2. So now we know two new symbols, the symbols for greater than and less than. So now we have 5 plus 2 and we have the number 8. I want to know whether 5 plus 2 is greater or less than or equal to 8. So if we start with 5 on our number line and go along 1, 2, we get to 7. So 5 plus 2 is 7. Now the number 7 is smaller or less than the number 8. So we need our less than symbol. And we know that we've used the right symbol here because we can think of the crocodile snapping at the larger number. Here we want to compare two different calculations. We've got 7 minus 1 and 2 plus 2. So let's start with 7 minus 1. If we're on 7 and we go back 1, we get to 6. And now let's look at 2 plus 2. If we're on 2 and we go along 1, 2, we get to 4. So is 7 minus 1 greater or less than 2 plus 2? Well 6 is greater than 4 so we need a symbol for greater than and there's our crocodile to check. Now we have 4 plus 2 and 7 subtract 1. So if I'm on 4 and I go along 1, 2 I get to 6. And if I'm on 7 and I go back 1, I get to 6 as well. So both calculations give us the answer 6. So I can't use our less than or greater than symbols because both of these calculations give us the same answer. They're the same value. So what am I going to use? Well here we need our equal sign to show that they give us the same answer.